There are two things we need to understand awareness and the mind let's define what they are let's define awareness as a glowing ball of light so you imagine an orb a glowing ball of light that can float around let's call that awareness and put that aside now let's define the mind let's define the mind as a vast space with many different areas within it one area of the mind is angry hatred jealousy joy happiness food art science technology whole bunch of different things right your awareness that ball of light can actually move to any area of the mind you want it to go to so if your awareness this glowing ball of light goes to the happy area of the mind it lights up that particular area of the mind you become conscious of being happy are you happy no you are in an area of the mind called happiness if this ball of light goes to that angry area of the mind it lights up the particular area of mind are you angry no you are in the area of the mind called anger and by using your will power and your power of concentration you can actually take your awareness this ball of light to any area of the mind that you want to go to so life is a manifestation of where you direct your energy it truly is you control where your awareness goes you control where your energy is flowing and you control what's manifesting in your life right now you are the sum total of where you have been investing your energy throughout your entire life all day we allow people and things around us to dictate where our awareness goes in our mind people and things are two of the biggest consumer of energy and people and things also give you a lot of energy each day we have this much energy we take our energy and we invest it into people and things around us we keep investing investing until we have no more energy left we get exhausted that usually 11 11:30 or maybe midnight we go to sleep our energy builds up again we go our the next day and we invest our energy into the people and the things until we have no more energy but the one thing most people don't do is we never evaluate who and what we are investing our energy in So I always tell people to treat energy the same you treat money. It's a finite resource that needs to be wisely managed, wisely reallocated and wisely invested. You get told to concentrate but you never get taught how to do it, right? If you want to be really good at concentration you need to practice it all day people are good at distraction because that's what they practice all day long it's not that they don't have that ability to concentrate they we just practice distraction and have become really really good at it I realize that life is for night that I only have one life as me 
and regardless of my beliefs i know i have one existence and a standard body and what happens after that i'm not quite sure and because my life is finite i want to be extremely clear where to focus my energy there is no point learning to concentrate if you don't know what is concentration of what to concentrate on to know yourself is one of the greatest gift you can give yourself it truly is right most people don't really understand themselves they don't understand what they want in life and therefore find it extremely difficult what to focus their finite amount of energy on proceed with confidence believe in your ability to manifest something in your life how to manifest something in your life you take your awareness you focus it on that thing you know how to develop concentration now keep your awareness on it when your awareness is on it that's where your energy is flowing when your energy flows start to manifest in your life and believe in your ability to do that proceed with confidence life is meant to be lived joyously it truly is and if you are not happy with the life then something needs to be changed if you ask most people what do they want in life they will always say i want to be happy happiness should never be pursued don't pursue happiness pursue a lifestyle that results in happiness and that's fair me what i do i never chase happiness i pursue lifestyle where the by product of the lifestyle is happiness in order to find out what's that lifestyle is i need to know what my purpose in life is in order to do that i need to spend time with myself to find out who and what's important in my life take that finite amount of energy that i have each day focus it on to these things that start to manifest into my life the by product of that is happiness this video is going to change your life change the way you think change your energy level i'd love to get subscribed from you share your love with this video share this video with your friends and family and let the world rise up be a part of that this is mr ocean subscribe like and share please thank you thanks for listening